Brian Ross investigates. Here now is ABC News Chief Investigative Correspondent, Brian Ross. Thank you for joining us. Mitt Romney has gone on the attack against his rival Newt Gingrich, raising questions about Gingrich's now infamous spending at Tiffany's, the New York jewelry store. But the fact is, Romney is by far the wealthiest of the candidates for president this year, with a net worth estimated at over a quarter billion dollars, with a B. And as we found, his taste can be every bit as lavish as those of Gingrich. Romney has not made public his latest federal tax returns, but financial disclosure forms required of all candidates reveal that he and his wife have had millions of dollars in offshore funds in the Cayman Islands and elsewhere, places that offer huge tax advantages to investors. Well, the primary advantage to setting those funds up in an offshore jurisdiction like the Cayman Islands or Bermuda is that it helps the investors avoid tax. The Romney campaign says he has paid taxes on all of his income, including the offshore investments, and the investments are now held in a blind trust. But tax experts say the fact that Romney's company, Bain Capital, under his leadership, established investment funds offshore in the first place helped them to attract business from people looking to avoid U.S. taxes. Romney's campaign says he may eventually make his tax returns public, but he declined our request to see them now. Well, by not disclosing his tax returns, we're not seeing how much he is earning or where he has investments and how much tax he's paying on whatever earnings he has.